everyone and welcome back to our channel. Today we'll be discussing in detail about how to create sales price list in Odoo 14. So pricing of products are very important uh, for successful business. So sometimes we have to change the price of products due to some factors or uh, during different seasons or occasions we have to change the price of products. So in that case price list are really helpful so if you go to sales module and inside configuration settings you will be able to find a, op an option that is price list so if you search for price list you can see an option and if you enable this there are two options too one is multiple prices per product and another one is advanced price rules so using multiple prices per, per product we can create multiple price rules for product uh, it is actually fixed prices we can create fixed price rules for product then in second case we can create uh, price rules with advanced options like discounts and using formulas we can compute price so first let us take the case of multiple prices for product and let's save the settings after that so when you enable this price list option you can see a menu under products that is price list here you can see created price list and using create button clicking that you can create new one Then for a company, you can apply this price list specifically. Then here we can add the price rules. So multiple price rules, rules can be created, added for one product or you can create price rules for different products. So adding aluminum box and adding minimum quantity one. And you can also apply uh, for uh, this price list specifically for a variant. So I'm not doing that. I'm giving price as 60 for this aluminum box. Then I can mention the price list validity. So from 21 to 30, this price list will be valid. So in the same way, we can add multiple uh, different price rule here for the same product. Suppose for three quantities, I'm setting the price as 200. Then, if you wish to add the start date and end date, you can do that. And if it is not added, then it will be this price will be valid for that is, it will be available every time. Then, you can see configuration where we can see availability. So, you can limit the availability of this price list to certain country groups. Then, you can set the discount policy as discount included in price or show public price and discount to customer then after that you can save this and let's create a sale order for this product so before selecting the products let's choose the price list so default price list and when you select the product aluminum box you can see unit price is 60 for quantity 1 as we have given inside the price list for quantity 1 unit, unit price should be 60 and when you change the quantity as 3 you can see the unit price changed to 200 so according to the rule we have set inside the price list so this is how we can it is done and you can see the subtotal here so that's how we make use of multiple price list per product and create price rules for products. Then now let's enable a second option that is advanced price rules using discounts and formulas. So here 
when you open uh, you can edit existing price list or you can create new one I'm not creating new one I'm just ed editing this one so here when you select this price rule you can see a new window open showing advanced advanced options so here you can apply this price list on all products or on product category or on a product or product variant so you can see so I'm not changing this I'm just applying this price list on aluminum box then minimum quantity then validity you can set or change that then here we have an option to select the price computation method that can be a fixed price or using or you can compute price as percentage or third option one is percentage third option is formula so you can compute the price using a formula that is new price that is new sales price is equal to old sales price minus price discount plus some char surcharge or extra charge suppose I'm adding price discount as 10 percentage and surcharge as 1 then here you, you can also apply to this formula a rounding method and minimum margin and maximum margin can be set for the product so this minimum margin is the uh, you can set, specify the minimum amount of margin over the basic price and maximum margin so these two are important in case of computing new sales price because if the minimum margin is greater than what you have given uh, sorry suppose I'm adding 5 and setting maximum margin as 10 and if the new computed sales price minus old sales price if it is greater than minimum margin then new sales price will be taken that is that will be the product sales price or uh, you can say have a second case where new sales price my new sales price minus old sales price is less than or equal to minimum margin in that case we compute the sales price as old sales price plus minimum margin and there is a third case where if new sales price minus old sales price is greater than maximum margin so in that case we will not take the extra margin we will only go up to a margin so new sales price must be increased by 10 only so this is how we compute the sales price of, of product so I'm just saving this So let's open our aluminum box and the product as if you set it as 100 let's see what happens so this is our old sales price and if you create sale order and let's select that product so before that we have to choose our price list okay. now let's add aluminum box so you can see the, see the unit price is 105 so this is because our old sales price is 100 and uh, new sales price minus old sales price is less than 5 so in that case what we have to do add the old sales price that is 100 plus our minimum margin that is 100 plus 5 so we got unit price as 105 so this is how we compute the price of product using that price rule so this is how we use second option in price list So that's all about using price list in code 14.
If you are interested in knowing more about this or looking for any order implementation or customization in your business, drop your request to odoatsyprocess.com.